Andrei Nikolaevich Tupolev was a pioneering Soviet aircraft designer. During his career, he designed and oversaw the design of more than 100 types of aircraft, some of which set 78 world records. In recognition of his work, he was made an honorary member of Britain's Royal Aeronautical Society and the American Institute of Aeronautics and Astronautics. He was honored in his own country by being made an academician of the Russian Academy of Sciences, Colonel General, and three times a hero of socialist labor. Early life, Topolev was born in the village of Pustomazovo, near the city of Kimri, Tver region, Russia. Topolev was the sixth of seven children born to his parents. After first being educated at home, he studied at the gymnasium in Tver and finished in 1908. He then applied for courses at two Russian universities and was accepted at both, Imperial Moscow Technical School and the Institute of Railway Engineers. He accepted the place at IMTU. In 1909, Topolev began studying aerodynamics under the Russian aviation pioneer N.E. Dukovsky. During this time he built one of the world's first wind tunnels which led to the formation of an aerodynamic laboratory at IMTU. In 1911, Topolev was accused of taking part in revolutionary activities, including demonstrations and distribution of subversive literature, and was arrested. He was later released on condition that he returned to his family home in Pustomazovo and was only allowed to return to IMTU in 1914. He completed his studies in 1918 and was awarded the degree of engineer mechanic when he presented his thesis on the development of seaplanes. By 1920 the IMTU had been renamed the Moscow Higher Technical School and Tupolev was teaching a course there on the basics of aerodynamic calculations. Work at Zagi. Topolev was a leading light of the Moscow based Central Aero and Hydrodynamics Institute from 1929 until his death in 1972. The Central Design Office at ESKB based the produced bombers and some airliners, which in the years before World War II were based partially, especially in his 1930s era designs, using the all metal aircraft design concepts pioneered by Hugo Junkers. In 1925, he designed a twin engine bomber, the TB 1, which was considered one of the most advanced designs of the time. By 1934, Topolev had led the design bureau that designed the largest aircraft flying in the world at the time, the 63-meter wingspan. Eight-engined Maxim Gorky, again built with the Junkers metal structure airframe concepts. In 1937, an improved version from the earlier TB-1, the four-engine TB-3 made a landing at the North Pole. As the number of qualified aircraft designers increased, Topolev set up his own office, producing a number of designs designated with the prefix and from his initials. However, on October 21, 1937, Topolev was arrested together with Vladimir Petliakov and the entire directorate of the Zagi and Edo and trumped up charges of sabotage, espionage and evading the Russian fascist party. Many of his colleagues were executed. In 1939, Topolev was moved from a prison to an NKVD Sharishka for aircraft designers in Bolshevo near Moscow, where many ex Zagi people had already been sent to work. The Sharishka soon moved to Moscow and was dubbed Topolevka after its most eminent inmate. Topolev was tried and convicted in 1940 with a 10 year sentence. During this time, he developed the Topolev 2 2. He was released in July 1941 to conduct important defense work. Quote, Topolev headed the major project of reverse engineering the American Boeing B-29 strategic bomber, which was the world's first nuclear delivery platform. 
The USSR had repeatedly asked unsuccessfully for Lend-Lease B-29S, using three machines which landed in Siberia after bombing Japan in 1945. Topolev succeeded in replicating them down to trivial detail. Moreover, he got it into volume production, with Kurz fully trained in time for the 1947 May Day Parade. The copy was designated 24, with many sub subsequent to aircraft having the number 4 in the designations. Design of the 295, by the time of his rehabilitation in 1955, Topolev had designed and was about to start testing his unique turboprop strategic bomber, the 295. In the years to come, he beat off able competition from Vladimir Masashchev and his M4 series of jet-powered strategic bombers, introducing the 216 design. This was in part thanks to Topolev. Topolev's close rapport with Nikita Khrushchev who had denounced Stalin's terror, which Topolev had been a victim of, commercial aviation. At about the same time, Topolev introduced into service the world's second jet airliner, the Tu-104. The aeroplane was the first jet transport to stay in uninterrupted service, and the only one in service anywhere in the world for two years until late 1958. It was followed by a series of two passenger jets, including the supersonic Tu-144, designed by Topolev's son Alexei Topolev. Loss of power in the Soviet Union After Khrushchev's removal from office in late 1964, the aging Tupolev gradually lost positions at the centers of power to rivals. Though the prestige 2144 program enjoyed top-level support until 1973, as did the important 2154 airliner, the favored position the Tupolev Design Bureau enjoyed through Tupolev's personal political connections was largely eclipsed by Ilyushin. To his contemporaries, Topolev was known as a witty but crude master of obscene vocabulary who invariably and energetically insisted on fast and adequate technical fixes, at the expense of scholastic ideal solutions. A hallmark of his was to get an aeroplane into service very rapidly, then began and often interminable process of improving the shortcomings of the quick and dirty initial design. To his competitors among the Soviet aircraft design community, he was known above all as politically astute, a shrewd and unforgiving rival. Topolev was buried in the Novodyavichi Cemetery in Moscow. Awards and Honors Hero of Socialist Labor Three Times Eight Orders of Lenin Order of the October Revolution Order of the Red Banner of Labor twice. Order of the Red Star. Order of the Badge of Honor. Order of Suvorov, second class. Order of the Patriotic War, first class. Lenin Prize. Stalin Prize. USSR State Prize. Order of Georgi Dimitrov, laureate of the Zhukovsky Academy of Sciences of the USSR. Gold Medal of the Phi Aviation. Leonardo da Vinci Prize, Gold Medal of the Society of the Founders of Air France, Honorary Fellow of the Royal Aeronautical Society of Great Britain and the American Institute of Aeronautics and Astronautics, Honorary Citizen of Paris, New York and the City of Zhukovsky, Moscow Oblast.